Hi everyone, I'm here today with my MAC lipsticks and this is my whole collection of my MAC lipsticks and I want to share the ones that I purchased with you. So I'm going to get started with This is a Satin Viva Glam 2, I believe, and the swatch looks like this. This is a mauve nude color. I don't really wear it a whole lot, but it does look good with people that have darker complexions. It's like they're nude, I feel like. The next lipstick that I have is a Cream Sheen, and it's Ravishing. This lipstick I love wearing with like a nude lip liner and um, I put this over it. This is like an orange peach color. It looks good for like the peach and um, peach lips, peach blushes and then either a green or brown smoky eye. This lipstick is a Viva Glam lipstick. It's Gaga. It's a luster and it's pink. This one, I I think it's a little too blue for me, but I do like it. I think it's very fun. This lipstick is one of my favorites. I got it back, I got it by um, Back to Mac, and so it was for free when I returned six tubes. And this is a cream sheen, and it's cross wires. This is a perfect spring color. It's so pretty. It is a berry color. This lipstick right here, I wore it to death in the summer. It's a luster, it's cut a caper, and um, it is very, it's pigmented for luster, and it's like um, a toned down cross, no, it's a toned down ravishing with a little more gloss in it. It's like an orange apricot color. The next color that I have is Viva Glam Cindy. This is a sheer red. It's like a candy, it's like a Jolly Rancher candy color. I should be wearing that a lot more right now, but I'm not. This next lipstick is Cream Sheen. Is a Cream Sheen and it's Fanfare. This is a beautiful color as well. I am down to just the minimum of it in the tube, but um, this is another awesome spring color, and it's um, right here. So the next lipstick is a Sheen Supreme, and this is got a dash. This is in the new in the peach family. I haven't had a chance to wear this a lot because I got it towards the end of summer, so it's similar to Ravishing. The next lipstick that I'm out of, this is like my second or third tube, is Angel, and this is like the perfect pink color. It's easy to wear. It's just a no-brainer. The next lipstick that I am down to the, the last of is Hue and this is a glaze and this is a very wearable color. It is um a very wearable nude. It's like it's glossy and um it's right there. It's more of a pink nude but not bright pink. The next color that I have is a frost and it's color me coral. And this is right there. This is definitely a summer color. The next lipstick that I have is Viva Glam 5 and this is a luster. I don't even wear it that often, but it's such a popular color and it's so wearable on many people. It has like little specks of sparkle in it and it is pretty. Um, I do like the luster glass with that or it's um, a lip glass. 
The next color I have is the Viva Glam Gaga 2. And this color is not that easy for me to wear either. I don't wear it a whole lot, but I need to wear lip liners with it. It's that... It's like a... A true nude with a hint of brown in it. The next color is Myth, and this is just a cancel my lip nude and um is it it's satin but it's kind of like a mattified color or formula and the next lipstick this is one of my most favorite lipsticks it was a special edition or limited edition um it's satin it's a satin and it's Toxic Tail. It came out in the Venomous Villains collection. This is a very bright color, but it's so beautiful in like the summer or spring. I just love this lipstick. It's so fun. It's one of my favorite MAC lipsticks ever. This one is Ruby Woo. Ruby Woo, and it's a matte red color. It's pretty bright. I use this to stain my lips, and it turns out very nice. The next color I have is Angel. No, yeah, it's Angel. Angel's actually a frost, which I don't understand, because it's not frosty at all. But the lax but the last thing that I have is this old MAC collection and it has about five Viva Glam lipsticks. This is Viva Glam 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And as you can see I'm out of a couple of them but this one right here, Viva Glam 1, is what I'm wearing today over this Revlon lipstick. And this is a really nice lipstick. It's matte number no. 9 Fabulous Fig. And here's a swatch of it. It's pretty close to Viva Glam 1. But it's a little deeper. So when I put Viva Glam 1 over it, it gives it like a brighter red effect. And this is my favorite lip combination for the fall. So that does it for my lipstick collection. There's a few other ones that I have not repurchased, like I love Cream Cup and Creme de Nude. I need to get another Hue, and I think I'm going to get another Angel. And I do um, have actually one more. This one I traded a friend. Whoa. This is Syrup, and this is a Luster. She traded me, or I traded her one of the lipsticks that I had that she recommended but didn't look good on me. We went to buy the lipsticks together. I got the last one. I didn't like it because it was too, I think it was twig. It was too rich and too dark on me. And we ended up swapping. And so this is syrup. I have not even really worn it, but um, it's like a purple lipstick. I think I'm going to try wearing it, but... That is it for my MAC lipstick collection. I hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you soon. Bye.